The next stage once you've created your own playlist is to share it with your students. If you go to your playlist, I'm just going to go back to the home page so we can see what we're doing here. So you start at your home page, go up to your channel, click on my channel, and go to your playlist. Once you're in your playlist, select the playlist that you'd like to use. Now that I have my playlist, you can see here that we can click on the playlist. And once I'm in here, I can edit the playlist. And this is where I have the share button. So you can see here that I can share this playlist with other people. You could embed this into a website. You could email it to people that you want to share it with, or you can share it by using the URL. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this and I'm going to open up another tab and I'm going to go to my classroom. So if you're using a Google Classroom, you can now take that URL, go into the class that you'd like to share it with. So I'm going to put it in my robotics class because I don't really use it for my robotics class. And once you're in here, we'll go to classwork, create an assignment. And in here, I'm just going to call it um, game-based learning and the instructions watch the following playlist on game-based learning apologize for my typing and provide your feelings about this style of learning. So you can do that. Then at the bottom here we can click on uh, the link. So we're going to go ahead and paste it. Add link. So then we have our playlist and you can go ahead and assign it. Alright, there you go. You now have a new lesson that you can provide to the kids. When they go to it, they click on the assignment and it'll open up to your playlist so they can see all the videos that you've included in your assignment. They can view them and then they can provide feedback and submit the assignment. All right, now it's your turn.